Catherine Pooler. Thanks for visiting my stamp room today. Well, out on a jog the other day, I was thinking about the fact that I was looking for a recipe for ganache frosting the other day. I did Google searches, I did YouTube searches, high and low, and I had trouble coming across a really good recipe for ganache frosting. Now, when it came down to it, ganache frosting is really a very simple thing to make, but since my expertise in the cooking and baking field is really small, I needed to find an expert to show me what to do. Then I was thinking how this is very comparable to the rubber stamping and scrapbooking world. You may really want to be a rubber stamper, a paper crafter, a scrapbooker, but you don't have the expertise. So I hope you'll turn to me when you find that you have certain questions about paper crafting. I've been a stamper for over 16 years and a Stampin' Up! demonstrator for eight. I spend a lot of time researching my craft and I always love to share it with my blog readers and my subscribers. So I hope you will turn to me when you have rubber stamping and scrapbooking questions. And if you visit my blog, www.katherinepooler.com, you can read more about the programs that I offer. But before you leave and go visit my blog, I want you to leave a comment here on YouTube and tell me what questions you do have. I know I have questions about ganache frosting. Well, what questions do you have about rubber stamping? I love to hear what they are so that I can deliver great content to you and know what you're thinking. So go ahead and leave a comment on YouTube. I can't wait to read all of them and I can't wait to start filming videos answering all the questions that are burning for you. Now, if anybody has a great recipe for a ganache frosting, go ahead and send it to me. Thanks so much, have a wonderful day.